In this video, we go going to implement RetroSense Sieve in Haskell. RetroSense Sieve allows us to get all prime numbers in a given interval. First of all, let's write a simple function which give, give us all multiple numbers for a given number, except that number. Ok, I call it uh, care and it gets some number on input. On output I want all multiple numbers. Oh, how can we get it? Uh, we can get uh, some range of numbers, natural numbers from 1 uh, to infinity. Ok, and uh, we can fmap uh, this uh, list uh, to uh, partial applied multiplication by n and um, in this way we get infinitely many numbers but we want um, some limit of numbers and I need to uh, add second argument I call it L uh, limit and uh, our range uh, will end with uh, we divide L to N ok and let's try to run our function for example 5 with 5 Oh, we 5 and 10. Okay, we get all multiples uh, in the range uh, from 2 to 10. And uh, for example, if I get 2, we get all multiples uh, for 2. Da? Uh, and if I get 3 to 100, I get all multiples to 100 for free. Now I need to remove our number n from this list because I want only multiple of this number except this number. Okay, and I will redefine my function. I will start from 2. And uh, now I will get a list to all multiples except except three. Okay, now I need to write a second function. I will call it g. And what it does, it does exactly what a Retosan algorithm do. It generates sieve. To generate sieve, I need to give to get a range of numbers from two to n and I need to fmap our care function to this range of numbers. Ok, I will flip I will flip uh, my care function and apply to it first argument n and I will get a function which I can fmap over a list. Ok, and let's try it. Ok, now we take a list of lists of composite numbers. Ok, what I do? I take a range from 2 to n of natural numbers and for each number I generate composite numbers. And now we have list of list. And if we look at this list, now we have all composite numbers in, the, in that range. And this bring us to great idea how can we get prime numbers. 
We should hack a RTSN Sith a little bit as it is described in Wikipedia. And all we need now to get set of all these composite numbers and get set of all natural numbers in that range and take the difference of each and we will get all prime numbers. Ok, let's do it. First of all, we need to import uh, two functions to work in with sets. First function from list to create a set from list and second function is difference to get a difference of two sets. Now let's redefine our G function. We need to concat list of lists to take one list. And from that they can get a set using our from list function. And now we can get all this set and take difference from with other set. The second set will be just a set of all natural numbers in a range to zero to n sorry okay take a difference okay didn't see my function I need to rewrite a little bit function name and uh, for function from lists also okay I need some dollar sign here to run this Okay, and now we get two sets and we take difference of them. Okay, now let's try to run our function with, say, number 100. Okay, we got all primes for 100 and all for 1000. We get all primes for 1000. And so it works. Okay. So with uh, these two functions, we got uh, Ertasen C in Haskell. You can check this code in uh, my repository. I put link in the description. Okay, thanks for watching and sorry for my English. This is my first English video. I am not a native speaker.